Hi and welcome back to my channel. This is Eric and this is Eric Discovers. Today I will show you how I do my face every day when I prepare for work. And if you want to know more about my skincare and my getting ready routine, please continue watching and do not forget to subscribe and click the bell icon button para you will be advised if I have a new video. So keep on watching! Um, kakatapos ko lang maligo, I just uh, wash my skin. And the first thing that I use uh, when getting ready for work is the vitamin C serum. No, the, this one, vitamin C suspension 30%. I made a review already of this product last week and I've been loving it. I'm sobrang naaadik ako dito. And uh, how I use it, I'll just get a few... Uh, piece size of the product and then put it on my skin like that. Ayan. Konti lang ang kailangan mong gamitin kasi some, if you use more, it's gonna leave like a white cast on your skin and you don't want that. Para siyang nagbubuo-buo. So, konti lang kailangan mong gamitin. Ayan. Um, mga first time mong gagamitin to, the first few days siguro you'll feel like a tingling sensation. Um, but for my skin, I was uh, my skin already adapted to the product so I don't feel that anymore. I use this during the night before I sleep and also um, when I prepare myself for work or when I'm going out, I would always use this. Um, sabi nila, um, hindi advisable to use a vitamin C during the day kasi the sun nga. Uh, oxidizes the product but for me I've been using it for quite some time and um, syempre it's also very important that uh, you put sunscreen on your skin every time that you go out kahit na hapon pa kahit gabi pa I think it's very important to really protect your skin and also sunblock or sunscreen or your SPF can also help prevent uh, oxidizing your vitamin C so ginagamit ko siya like right after I put my vitamin C. Okay, next product is the Ordinary Caffeine Solution. Again, I think this is going to be part of my uh, skincare regimen. I use this at night and also during the day. One thing that I love about this product, okay, kasi nung unang review ko, wala akong masyadong nasabi about it, about my experience with the product because I haven't really used it. I mean, I've been using it, pero it's just for a few days. Um, pero now, it's been a week since I started using the caffeine solution. And para siyang vacuum for your, para siyang mini liposuction for your puffiness. As in, parang, parang pinapaliit niya yung eye bags mo. It shrinks your, your, your puffy eyes instantly. Not in say, mga around a minute after applying it. And sobrang konti lang nang kailangan mong ilagay. Like, a drop of the product, like that. Sobrang konti lang. And the bottle comes in, uh, or the product comes in a 30ml bottle. So sobrang, siguro ang isang bottle mo would last you for siguro 3 months or more. And so you just put it under the eye like that. And also do not forget your eyelids. Ayan. And also, it doesn't sting your eyes. But, siguro hindi ko, hindi pa naman siya makakasok sa mata ko. Pero, it's not irritating at all. Kasi meron ako mga na-try na um, eye serum before, na when you apply it under your eye, parang it burns. I don't know why. Pero this one talaga, it's very mild. And I think it's very helpful kung you are suffering from puffy eyes. I'm sure a lot of you or a lot of us suffers from it especially as soon as we wake up in uh, in the morning or lalo na pag hindi ka masyadong nakakuha ng tulog. Like me, ako madalas akong ganun. So, nagde-develop talaga yung eye bags and puffiness and dark circles. So, this is very helpful. Promise. As in, I I will bet my name on it. O, oh, ba? So, just let it stay on your eye. I mean, not on your eye. On your skin, give it a good 30 seconds to a minute. Ako, normally, I would let it stay for about 2 minutes before I start putting another product on my skin. And, um, pinapatuyo ko lang siya. Okay. 
so now that my skin was able to absorb absorb the product i will now use another product to lock in everything that i put on my skin also to protect my skin um i was using an spf um well i was using an spf by by another brand pero i'll do another review yun favorite ko rin yun. pero for the past two days i've been using this ayan I white bb holic everyday bb cream one thing that i love about this product it doesn't make my skin too oily kasi uh, in the past i was using uh, bb cream kaya lang ang problema ko sa bb cream since i have oily skin parang it makes my skin so oily like a few hours uh, pa lang para na akong nagbuhos ng mantika sa mukha this one i like this kasi para siyang tinted moisturizer lang. Um, may, wala, siyang, wala siyang masyadong coverage. Pero one thing that I love about this product, um, yung ingredients niya. Okay? Um, ilalagay ko na lang sa ilalim yung ingredients niya. Pero, like for the active ingredients, it has niacinamide, aloe, barbadensis. Oh, yung niacinamide, it's also good for skin brightening and also skin rejuvenating. Yung aloe vera, so it's aloe vera, so it's very soothing on your skin. Kung halimbawa, um, you're suffering from skin irritation, aloe vera will help. And it also has Portulaca oleracea eh, extract. I don't know what that is. But I extract, so meaning natural. <laughs> um, citrus para citrus paradisi or grapefruit extract. Ayan. So, vitamins and then I cannot stress enough how important it is to to treat your skin with vitamin C. Um, kung mahilig kang mag oral vitamin C, topical vitamin C is really helpful, especially if you want to rejuvenate your skin, build collagen, brighten your skin. Please, please, please include vitamin C on your skin regimen. Ayan. So anyway, so I'll put this on my skin na. Sobrang konti lang ang kailangan ko. Yeah. So, para ka na naglalagay ng moisturizer, hindi naman siya katulad ng mga foundation na sobrang heavy. And it's very blendable. It just gives your skin like parang that natural glow. It evens out your skin tone. Ayan. At sobrang, sobrang nabiblend. I don't use uh, blending blending uh, sponge anymore when I apply this. I just use my fingers. Kasi nga, ayoko nang masyadong heavy. Yeah. I just put a little extra under the eye. A little extra. Pero not really to conceal it. Para lang, ano, para lang pantay siya. Sometimes you have to be proud then with your dark circles, no? At saka, <laughs> eye bags. Pinagpuyatan mo kaya yan. <laughs> oh, by the way, this is in the color light. Okay, this is in the color light. Meron silang parang natural color or beige color. If you have a little bit uh, tan skin, you can buy that. Pero ako, I like the light kasi um, obviously, my skin is a little acidic lately kasi nga, di ba, nagpa-vitamin C ako. And after a few minutes naman, nagbe-blend na siya sa skin ko. So pag ko mag, mag-BB cream, um, para lang hindi siya mahulas ka agad. Hindi ako, nag, hindi ako nagpa-powder foundation, but I use a powder that I really, really like, surprisingly. Um, eto, nakikita, meron naman mga ganito, Pons angel face natural mattifying uv uvb protection in the color blue this is what i use kasi yung pink meron din akong ganun kaya lang i gave it i gave it to somebody else na nung nakabili ako nito um so ito yung parang pinagsiset ko sa aking uh, face again i don't use any tools anymore when i am um when i am preparing in the morning kasi mabilisan lang so i just use it like this, I put some on my palms, and then, and dab it like that. Para hindi masyadong marami, parang enough lang na parang 
mabawasan yung pagka-shininess ng aking face. Ayan. And that's it. Hmm. Hindi mo na kailangan pagpagin kasi yung excess powder na pupunta naman sa kamay mo. So, hindi mo na kailangan pang i-brush or i-blend. So, yun na. And, syempre yung last is Kilay. Kilay is life. I'm using Brow Lasting Waterproof Eyebrow Pencil by The Body Shop. I got this. Mga 2 weeks ko na siyang ginagamit or 3 weeks. It's about 300 or 400 pesos. Lalagay ko na lang yung description later. So, basahin niyo na lang sa baba. Um, the color is gray. Yeah. Dark gray. Kasi nga, syempre, hindi ako pwedeng mag-dark brown or light brown dahil my natural hair color is black. So, I'm using uh, dark gray. It, it, this, I don't use this to like really define my eyebrows. Parang ang ginagawa lang niya is parang nagka-cast lang siya ng shadow sa eyebrows ko to make it look like it's thicker. Kasi I don't... I mean, my eyebrows is very weird. Kasi makapal dito sa gitna, pero sa dulo... Parang sparse lang siya. So, dito ako nagpo-focus. Parang dinadagdagan ko lang. Hindi yung tipong... Um, ano ba tato? I don't define my eyebrows that much. Kasi it makes you look so unnatural. So, parang ano lang. Actually, I don't even pluck my eyebrows anymore. I let it grow like that. Kasi nga ngayon, di ba? Ang trend is the bushier, the better. And the more natural it looks, the better. So, I don't pluck or I don't shave it anymore. I just let it grow like that. Ayan. So, maglalagay na ako. Ah, by the way, gusto ko pala dito kasi automatic siya. Ayan. Hindi mo na kailangan siyang tasahan. And it comes with this pulley at the other end. So, syempre, you just brush lang muna your eyebrows ng konti. Okay. And then apply. So, very simple. I'll just do this. Again, it doesn't have to be refined, ah. Kailangan lang madagdagan yung mga dapat dagdagan. Again, this is not like a eyebrow tutorial, ha. Yun lang. And I'm okay. Siguro konti lang dito. And then don't forget to brush it like that. Okay. Other side. And one thing that I love about this eyebrow pencil is that sobrang long lasting niya. And that's it. Yeah. So, di ba? Mas bushier lang siya ng konti. Pero it doesn't really define my eyebrows like, ano, like nobody's business. Yeah. Sorry ha, nangungulit ang aking pusa. Guys, meet my cat, Ferragamo. Maybe cut later na. Nag-video pa si Dada. Hmm? To really set my eyebrows, but not really super define it, I all I use Bro Precise Fiber Volumizer by Maybelline. I got this mga two weeks ago. So, syempre, ginagamit ko muna para mas mabigyan ko ng justice when I do a sort of a review about it. Um, the color is deep brown. Sobrang dark niya. And it comes in a 8 ml tube or bottle, if you may. At ganito yung kanyang spoolie. I hope na kita. Pero flat siya on the other side and then rounder, rounded siya on the other side. If you can actually see, I don't know if you can see it. Meron siyang parang mga fibers sticking sticking out. And I, I guess this helps in building the volume. And one thing that I like about this product is that it sets like crazy. It's hard. Once you apply it, give it like a good 15-30 seconds at matigas na yung buhok mo. Ayun. So, make sure lang na when you apply it, bilisan mo yung pag apply and then you don't have to reapply uh, in the middle of the day kasi matigas na nga siya. At saka pag nag-reapply ka, magka-clump yung eyebrow mo. At saka hindi siya, hindi na siya mukhang natural. 
So this is how I do it, Fonten product. And then I'll just brush it like that. Again, sobrang dali lang gamitin itong product na to. It needs microblading if you know how to use your product. Chara. Okay. Ayan. Mm. Natural looking eyebrows. Oh, di ba? Perfect. Love it. Okay. And that's it, ladies and gentlemen. That's how I get ready. Of course, I'm just gonna you know blow dry my hair but that's how i do my face every day um if you do like what i did today and if you like my channel if you have any comments halimbawa may iba ka pang product na ginagamit if you have any question please do comment down below and please don't forget to like and subscribe i would really appreciate it thank you so much and i love you all shambre do not forget your lips um if you have dry lips, ako, I don't put lipstick anymore, pero um, there's one product that I use. It's um, Magic Balm by Lips Diva. Ayan, sobrang love ko to kasi it's very soothing, it's very moisturizing, and it leaves like a tint of parang pinkish red on your lips. Sobrang mura lang ito. Parang 100 lang ata ito. I can't remember. Pero sobrang mura. This will last you for a long time. At saka maganda sa kanya kasi parang minty. Ayan, very smoothing. So I really love this. Lips Diva uh, Magic Balm. Healing Soothing. Lip and Cheek Balm. Ayan, pwede rin siya sa cheek. Pero ako ayoko na. Okay na ako lang ganito.